Alright, guys. Um, basically, this is another kind of driving level. Only, um, it's like... There are three. There are three types of levels in this game. There are three types of levels. There's a uh, regular platforming levels that are the most um, prominent levels in the game. There are paddy driving levels, which only happen three or four times in the game. And then there are these these um kind of uphill downhill sliding things. <coughs> Sorry. Okay, so. There are a few of these in the game. There aren't that many in the game, but um, I'm sorry. You guys can like turn off my commentary this time if you want, because I'm not really feeling best today. I have a annoying cold, and I just I don't know. I'm glad it's a weekend night right now. I right, see. So you saw the extra up there. And we can't get that extra until we come to the level a second time. So, if you want to get the extra, finish the level first and then come back with either a time challenge or just regular going down the whole thing. Hill for fun. And I believe that you have to get that extra on the ring challenge. So actually, don't return to the level unless you're willing to do the ring challenge. Basically, the ring challenge is, um... Where you have to run, go through a bunch of rings, and if you miss a ring, you basically lose because you can't go backwards in this, um, in these kinds of levels. Um, and those part, that part is pretty simple. I mean, just look out for the shadows. You can get hit once or twice. There are lots of Kai patties in this level. It's hard to die in these kinds of levels. Well, actually, it, it, what am I talking about? Um, it's hard to die because of loss of health. That's what I meant to say. Because there aren't many, uh, there aren't many opportunities to lose health in this level. Uh, most of the time, you'll only, you'll only lose health because, you know, you'll um, fall down, and that's the only reason that you'll die. And they have a lot of checkpoints everywhere, so that's not really much of a problem. Oh, okay. Now, if you've been following this guide, I believe that the next level, we won't have to backtrack at all, because we'll have enough um, Goofy Goober tokens to learn a new move for Patrick. But I'm not sure. I think it's 10, but it might be 12 or 13, and that, that'd be a problem. That'd mean that we'd have to backtrack. Actually, wait, no. Oh, no, we wouldn't have to. It's, it's probably 12, and then we'll, we'll have enough effort in the level. So. Because um, right now, I'm going to be doing all of the... Oh, I got I got a point. Oh, that's pretty cool. I got a point. Okay, so... Um, in this guide, I'm going to be trying to get as many spatulas on my first... I mean, no, what I'm talking about. As many goofy tokens as possible on my first run. So, um, not including these levels. Because these levels you're only going to be doing at the end of the game. You're only going to be coming back to it at, at the end of the game. Okay, now here, don't go this way because that's going to take you back to the beginning of the, beginning of the level. Go this way instead. Alright, so, um... Now for this part, you can go this way and, you know, go the hard way. It, it doesn't make a difference, um... On your first run through the level. I mean, you go a lot faster, but... That's all that really happens. Um, you can, you don't have to do that. I think you actually have to do that part for the ring challenge. Um, because they place rings there. And that's all towers destroyed, yay. And that took us three minutes, pretty good. Okay, so, I'll see you guys next time.